Hello! So you're looking for a way to trap and keep a Rainio for multiple pregnancies? Well, let's jump into it. The first thing we need to discuss is the reason traps do not seem to work in ASA with a Rainio. Unlike the Sino, the Rainio does not have a code that will not let it impregnate near structures. The main reason trapped Rainios do not impregnate has to do with their animations. If you haven't noticed yet, just about every animation in ASA can be interrupted by being pushed or bumped into something. Wildcard added a collision animation for players and some, if not all, dinos. So collision changes the animation state. The issue with the animation state changing with collision is that the Rhino's pregnancy ability is tied directly to its animation, at least currently. So if the Rhino bumps anything while flying up to impregnate, the ability gets interrupted and fails. So how do we get around this? Well, we'll build a trap that works most of the time, not all the time. I've tested several traps and several different size traps. And the one that works the best is about 18 by 20 foundations and 12 walls high, plus a 4 by 6 airlock. That's also 12 walls high. Two foundation, wall, and ceiling off the entire trap, you will need 390 foundations, 400 ceilings, 900 walls, two behemoth gates and doors, and possibly one cellar door. Now, of course, you can lessen the amount needed by almost half if you do not want to close the whole box in by simply putting a wall every other row and a ceiling every other row. You can then greatly cut the foundations down by placing a row of foundations, skipping two rows and placing the next row, and so on. Since this is basically a box, we're not going to waste time going into how to build a box. If you would like to see the trap built and getting building tips, let me know in the comments. If we get enough interest, we can make a video over it. It takes quite some time to build this beast though. To use the trap, simply have the doors open. It is easiest to use a pterodon or RG, and make sure to have a trap door or a space open enough that the pterodon or RG can get through, but not the Rhino. Kite and Rhino Ganatha back to the trap. Try to dodge the sap attacks so you do not get stuck. Use left alt to look behind you while flying. Now if you build the trap with at least one row of walls left off, simply fly through the opening and set the flyer on the ground and the Rhino will try to attack it while you run around and close the door. If it's completely boxed in with no way out other than the entrance, close the gate and fly through the last moment. I do not recommend this though. Of course, if you have tribe mates, you can just have them close the gate. Now, Captain Fat Dog has a really good trap that holds the Rhino down so you can lower its hit points. It might be a good idea to build Captain Fat Dog's trap inside of this one, and there's less chance of the Rhino escaping, and you also don't hit the can't attack your dinos while you're damaging it. Now, the airlock. Once you have a Rhino, as long as the airlock is four foundations long, a Bronto can fit in it and you can close the door behind it, then you can open the gate to the trap and walk the Bronto in with no fear that the Rhino might fly out. Let us know in the comments below if you've found a high level Rhino yet. Now it is best to drop the Rhino's hit points before bringing the dino you wish to get pregnant to avoid the dino taking too much damage. The trap does not work 100% of the time and may need a few tries to get the dino pregnant, so make sure to have a date on handy to heal up the sacrificial dino. And if you find the Rhino is hitting their ceiling too often and failing the animation, you'd always try increasing the ceiling height by another 3 to 4 walls high. Now with this trap, you can now impregnate as many dinos as possible with just one female Rhino. If you want to know how the rest of the Rhino taming process works, make sure to check out my Rhino guides. I will link them in the cards above and the description below. If you enjoyed the video, smash that like button. Have an awesome day.